in the current version of the future logo, I, I was Googling and it's actually supposed to be spelled with an E at the end. It's unbelievable. Thank you. Yeah. It's Thank truly you. unbelievable. It's very clearly a joke. The entire thing is very clearly a joke. Um, at least we thought it was clearly a joke. We'll wait till we get to the comments in a second. Everybody, Jonathan here from AJ and Smart, and we've just hit 100,000 uh, subscribers on YouTube, which is really, really cool. Thank you to everyone who subscribed. Where everyone who didn't describe yet, didn't describe yet, didn't describe yet. Please subscribe. What I wanted to do is actually just take a look at some of the videos we've released over the years and react to them. So I'm going to go back. We've been making videos for three years on this channel. The company's completely changed in this time. One thing that's actually stayed consistent is that we've been releasing videos for three years pretty much non-stop and it's so fun it's one of my favorite parts of my job um, is putting videos out on YouTube so I wanted to react to some of them um, and a couple of you have wanted me to react to a specific one for quite a while as well um, and that is me redesigning Chris Doe's logo uh, which obviously uh, got a lot of attention and a lot of people got very angry which is why I think it's funny to react to that one so let's take a look at the very first video uh, that I was ever in. This was um, created by Brittany. Brittany was working at AJ and Smart until last year and was a huge part of the whole YouTube channel uh, starting. She was actually hired to be uh, uh, a user tester and ended up being um, a videographer and video editor. And this is the first video we made together at like 6 a.m. before the office opened. Check out my hair, it's epic. So this is March 28th, 2017. This exercise that I'm going to show you is oh basically a way to cut out the useless, unstructured conversation that you... She actually um, shot and edited this in the same day, so it's really impressive. ...exercise that we're going to show you. I'm going to be the moderator. Oh you can see I'm both taking... The hair. Part. The hair is epic. I can do... I can make my hair like this if I want to again. So this is cool. I mean, you see a lot of people uh, who are not at AJ and Smart. This is Michael, my uh, co-founder. Um, he now lives in Australia. Actually, both uh, Bruna and Kyle are still at AJ and Smart. Um, yeah, so funny. This was when we just had this one office as well. We now have the other side. Uh, so funny to see this. It's kind of got this like, you know, reality TV show, like with the jerky camera thing. I actually really like it. I think it was a very good first video to put out. We've got 95,000 views on it, which isn't too bad. Who knows, maybe we ran an ad on it. The office is even quite different. That's really, really cool to see. So this is the first video we brought out, um, yeah, three, three years ago, which is kind of crazy. Here's another one. Uh, this was actually a remake of that video that you just saw. Um, this remake, this was remade like a, over a year later with myself and Brittany. Um, my hair is more similar to how it is now. I actually look a little bit unhealthy here. <laughs> the stress of running a business. Um, it was always fun to, always fun making videos with Brittany because um, we just had a good kind of on camera chemistry, I think. The office environment, but everyone has something a little bit different. So, we okay, the audio is really bad in this video. I remember we messed up the audio on this one. We, it took us a long time to sort of, Big, like making videos is really difficult and it was it was just like it's, it took us years to really build up this like system of bringing out videos really quickly come to any conclusions so we're going to use lightning decision jam to actually so weird solve. to see the the room set up like this yeah it's going to be really exciting or, or it won't be it won't be boring i think you'll like it you'll like it you can yeah. barely hear what we're saying but there's a good there's a good vibe it's funny it's a funny one i think this one ends with us dancing kind yeah. of sat in terms of how difficult it would be and how much they're likely to work. We're then able to just take something from the top left Super fun. and turn it. I really like that video. Yeah, the, this video, um, really fun. Really like making uh, vids with Brit. Oh, I want to show you this other one first. I want to show you a show. This is Fedor. Uh, Fedor used to work at AJ and Smart. He's a great, great, great designer, actually. Fantastic UI designer. Um, you should definitely search him. Fedor Shakora. Um, I'm very, I'm also very sweaty in this video. This was a show I was trying to do for a long time called the Sunday Slap, where we would review things in slaps. Um, didn't really, we didn't manage to actually keep it up, but. Hello, welcome to the Sunday Slap. My name is Jonathan. And I'm Fodor. I'm Bruna. 
my my kind of concept behind the Sunday slap is that it would be edited like a crazy fast YouTube video with loads of really bad zooms and all this kind of stuff. Um, it actually did quite well, uh, but I think that it just it just was too difficult to create this show regularly. Maybe you need to put those names on the screen because <laughs> lots of foreign sounding. We don't yeah. know our names. <laughs> so the, the Sunday Slap, if you don't know, if this is your first time, it's a show about the biggest news in tech and product. So the slap noises, we would review everything in slaps. Over, of the week. So we take a look at what happened in the week. And we give you an entertaining overview of all the things that happened. And we do it live from the Bruno. AJ Smart <laughs> office. So it gets a little bit loud and steamy. So let's take a look at what topics I have this week for you. <laughs> no topics. None. Good job, nothing. Jonathan. Good job. <laughs> Literally nothing <laughs> happened this week at all. Okay, so that's the Sunday slap. I really enjoyed making those. One day we'll bring it back. But it was just ugh, it was just a time at AJ and Smart. Things were too chaotic. We couldn't get it made. This is actually one of my favorite videos of all time. This is really interesting. So Chris Doe. Uh, he's the he's the guy who runs the company the future he came to Berlin and we made a couple of videos together and it was super super fun and we had it was a we were just making like loads of joke videos and one of the videos we both thought would be really fun to do would be that Chris Doe uh, redesigns our logo and I would redesign uh, the future's logo and the idea was that it would be funny because I don't know how to design a logo and uh, Chris Doe is like a famous like designer. Um, so I thought that would be obvious that people would get the joke. So I'll show you the I'll show you the logo designs that so like I'll just show you a little bit. So we made it so that you know Chris you know really didn't like what I created for him and that I was playing this character of like I'm a really serious creative director and I'm trying to you know I'm trying to like sell the idea to him and that I don't get how bad the logo is so I mean it's very clearly a joke the entire thing is very clearly a joke um, at least we thought it was clearly a joke we'll wait till we get to the comments in a second so first of all Chris actually did a really good logo for us it was actually really cool um, because he's a very good designer, a very good graphic designer. Um, actually, just a, a really cool idea, kind of taking the idea of the post-its and making it into a, into a concept. And then I made this piece of crap, which was basically changing the Futures logo to brown, um, changing the E. Like, you have to listen to my explanation. Um, I added legs to him as well, and you can still see the stock image. The Future logo. I, I was Googling and it's actually supposed to be spelled with an E at the end. So I'm telling him that the future is supposed to be spelled with an E. The future actually has an E at the end. Yeah. And so I matched up the font and put it in. So you all, you basically can't know. I changed the, the color to brown. So <laughs> Chris, Chris kept a really straight face. And this is, this is how he was in all of our joke videos. We were playing this thing. I mean, it is also, you know, pretty real. Like I am a, like a, trickster or whatever i'm a joker i'm a troll um and chris is just like really excellent at what he does but he's also not stupid he got that we we, we were doing this together and it was a joke we thought it would be entertaining for people so anyway it's more flesh um, tone so like he's joking <laughs> about it as well <laughs> yeah i took Wait. it from the legs so here's the motivate innovate equals global you your company is about motivating, innovating on a global scale. Yeah. Global mm -hmm. equals global. And then, but it's also the logo. It's not just the slogan. This is also- So anyway, myself and Chris, we, yeah, we made this video and I kind of, I assumed that 99% of people would get that it's a joke. But as with a lot of things we do at AJ and Smart, often people don't realize sort of the sarcasm so let's have a look at what people thought. I feel so sorry for Chris. Um, I don't know how Chris didn't lose his shit. He's uh, then again, John. Okay, wait. There's some. There's some. There's some angry ones here. Chris was actually doing. Uh, Chris was actually doing something. This guy was playing around. It would be more interesting if Jonathan took it seriously. Maybe it would be more interesting. But the whole point of the vote joke was, video was that it was a joke. Uh, <laughs> Chris doing his best to make a cool logo. The other guy, haha, I'm so funny, haha. People got angry. People were pissed. <laughs> 
kudos on Chris for being a good sport. As if we just tricked him into making this video. Chris was with, yeah. I guess we could have made it more clear for, I mean, there are, you know, people on YouTube are maybe not, I'm not saying not that smart, <laughs> but you know, if, if, if people don't realize that this is a joke, um, it's kind of crazy. Jonathan is afraid of Chris, so he turned it into a joke. So pe uh, people think that halfway through, I was like, oh my God, wait a second. I don't know how to, <laughs> how to design logos. Um, of course, this is the, uh, the thing with ne negative comments. Uh, uh, 4.3 thousand people liked it, uh, 800 didn't. The negative comments are always up at the top. I haven't been laughing that hard for such a long time. I love Chris and John. So this made my year. That's the thing with negative comments, especially on YouTube. You have to remember angry people are people who are like, um, people who just want to like be angry on the internet are always the first to comment. But you have to kind of think, wait, but are there people out there who actually enjoy the things you make and then focus on them? So I, basically the way that works is if I watch the video and I think it's funny and if my team here think it's funny, um, yeah, then we still post it. Like pe there, there are people who actually got that this was a joke. Anyway, this was one of my favorite uh, videos we've ever made. Chris is, Chris is such a, a, I mean, he's also laughing during this, by the way. Of your company, you're proud of what you've done. But he's trying to hold in the laughter. You see that? Like how? How do it look? Like we're all we're all in on the joke. We're all playing this thing we thought it would be funny for people, um, and yet you you almost need to have like a a banner up on the top of the video that says the entire time that this is a joke. We even had to add in, I think, a bit of text here. Just a quick note for those running, uh, but somehow thought this was a serious battle. It wasn't. So. Um, although Chris would win in the real life version as well, right? I, I, I can't, I'm not a good logo designer at all. Chris would have won. But this, this for me was really one of my favorite videos of all time. Um, it's, it's super fun. And it was a perfect combo of, you know, Brittany doing a really great job uh, hosting it. Chris doing a really great, great job just being this like titan of design. And I think I did a good job of being like the the the, the trickster and, and playing around with it. Um, but that I think I think this was maybe my favorite AJ and Smart video of all time. The one that I every so often will go back to and just laugh about. And I think what makes it extra funny for me is that so many people thought it was. Look at this one. Oh my God, look at this comment. I remember we shared this internally. I feel kind of ashamed of being German right now. By the way, I'm not German, I'm Irish, um, but I live in Germany. Absolute waste of Chris and most viewers' time. Einfach, uh, that means like, lächerlich means like embarrassing. <laughs> oh my God, like imagine, imagine you, imagine you think like, it, it, uh, I mean, fair enough. People don't have the context. They don't know that we hung around for two days talking about different funny ideas to make videos from. There were times when I saw the comments for this and I was just like, we actually even have other uh, videos with Chris where I'm like, shit, like we have this one that I really like where Chris fires me for being a bad designer. And I'm thinking, oh shit, like I, I think that now that people thought this one was a joke, this was the silliest one. If they think this one is a joke, it will be impossible for them to get the sarcasm from the other videos. So let me know in the comments if you want me to release some of the other videos that Chris and I made, uh, but I really love Chris. And also, by the way, their channel is is one of our biggest inspirations, the future. Um, yeah, I think those are the videos. I also like this one. This is one more. I'll, I'll throw this in, in as the last one um, because Callum did a great job just adding a bird. There was a bird making a lot of noise in this video. And uh, let, just take a look. Hey, in this video, we're gonna talk about the difference between junior and senior UX designers. If we can get through it with this bird outside going crazy. No, there's a bird right there. Was there. A, there was just this bird. There was this bird, which you could hear in the start of this video, UX design careers, how to get from junior. You can hear it, it's so loud. Like, just listen to me talking and how loud the bird is underneath us. Hey, in this video, we're gonna talk about the difference between junior and senior UX designers. <laughs> if we can get... It's a... 
<laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> All right. Well, look, anyway, thank you so much to everyone who's subscribed to this channel. Um, thank you to everyone who's um, supported us over the last three years. Um, the company has been here for nine years, but we've only kind of been public for the last three years. Um, even to the people leaving negative comments, if you eventually stuck around and subscribed and liked our channel eventually, well, thank you very much. Um, we are going to keep posting on YouTube. We really enjoy it. Uh, we're going to try to get to 200K. We still don't have a real deep plan for the channel. We're not like, we don't even know exactly how to make money from it or anything like that. But for us, you know, we're running an agency and this is kind of a cool side hobby to do. And it also sometimes gets us clients, which is also cool. Um, but yeah, thank you. Thank you all. That's 100,000 followers. These are some of my favorite videos that we made over the last three years. Uh, three years. Um, it's also cool like to, you know, see so many ex-colleagues in these videos, like just like as a good like memory of, oh, what was the company like three years ago? What was it like two years ago? Because so much has changed in the last few years. Um, and it's, yeah, it's just super cool to see that. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, let us know in the comments uh, what videos you'd like us to see on our road to 200K. And just tell us what was your favorite, uh, what was your favorite AJ and Smart video over the last few years? Thank you so much. Have a really, 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 really lovely day, weekend, whatever. Goodbye.